friends happy saturday how are you guys doing i know it has been a week it's been a while you guys that i even uploaded a video or anything um but last week has just been a lot it has been a lot so much that was going on um working a whole lot and i was supposed to have my inspection for my daycare so i we were just like over time just trying to get the daycare finalized and and everything put together for it all the little ins and outs and technical things like fire extinguisher fire alarms carbon monoxide you know making sure that if there are any peeling paint inside or outside that that was taken care of um, electrical outlets, you know, all the things that a fire inspector looks for. Um, so we were kind of just going around the entire house and we had his list and trying to get all that together. So it definitely has been a week and I am so glad that is over. Um, unfortunately, he wasn't able to make it. It was supposed to be for Thursday, the 20th, but he wasn't able to make it. So it's now the 1st of November, which is my birthday. <laughs> um, he's going to be there. So it's confirmed and, and everything that he's going to make it on the 1st. So uh, the good thing is that we're done. <laughs> We're done with all the, the little things. Um, I think the only thing that's left now is to um, order my desk and chairs and my rug. So going to be doing that this week. And um, hopefully it'll be here before the first. So, But just wanted to just stop in and say hi. And I know I'm looking a hot mess. Y'all know I'm, I'm in bed. Actually, when I'm filming this, it's a Saturday morning. I called out on Friday because y'all, I was exhausted between working and between the everything with the daycare that we had to get done. And then with my kids and life, y'all, I was so tired. My body was hurting. My head was hurting. My eyes was burning. Like I just physically, I physically couldn't do it. And I felt so bad because I don't like to call out um, at work and I, I hate to leave that burden on my supervisor because she is the best. She's amazing. But I was so tired and I just felt like I physically could not do it. Um, so I, it just feels so good to wake up on a Saturday morning. Um, so when you guys see this video, it is going to be on a Monday. Um, but today I'm just going to take you around my day. I have lots and lots and lots of things to do today um, and I'm going to take you guys around just to show you. I want to start making my um, cutting board wall and my, you know, mounted plate rack wall. I want to start making that. So I'm going to take you guys around with that. And also I want to start getting Christmas prepped. So I want to start pulling up the trees and checking them to make sure that all the lights are working and everything. Um, I also want to um, start moving around some furniture like I already started, but I want to continue to do that. I need to get the dining room table out of the dining room and get that set and ready for the um, the kids room, the school age kids room. I think I told you guys about that. We're going to make our dining room into the school age kids room. It's only going to be for a little while because we're turning the garage into the daycare, um, hopefully next year. So we can get our dining room back. We can get our home back and everything. But for now, we just have to sacrifice and use the space that we have. Um, so we're not going to have a dining room for maybe a good year. We're not going to have a dining room for maybe a good year. And so we're just trying to, um, you know, just do what to do, make do with what we have and with the space that we have. Um, everyone's on board with it. Everybody's okay with it. We eat in the living room and that's okay. I'm going to see if I can find like a sofa table that I can put like maybe stools underneath it and then we can eat there, you know, kind of just multi-purpose the space. But um, 
I'm going to take you guys around today. I have a wall that I want to paint. So I'm going to do that. I still have loads of laundry to do. And I changed my room around. I got the paint for my bedroom wall. So I'm going to try to see if I can do that. Um, and if I can do that, that'll just be a great win. I moved my bed. These two walls. I want to see if I could paint those two walls. I did go ahead and buy the paint. Um, so that is what I'm going to try to accomplish for the day. Hopefully I can get it all done, you guys. It's a whole lot to get done, but I want to start moving into um, decorating for Christmas, but I have to get my space prepped and ready for what I exactly want to get done. So I've been going through all my Christmas decor and y'all, it's just, I have so much <laughs> decor. I did stop by Walmart um, and I did order something from Walmart and um, just a few little things that I wanted to add to my vintage Christmas spectacular, I guess you want to call it. Not a spectacular, but my vintage Christmas this year. That is definitely my theme. I love everything vintage and old and traditional and beautiful. So um, I also want to paint my dressers, but I don't think I'm going to get to that today because I'm already doing a lot of painting. <laughs> But I just want to take you guys around with me for the day um, and just kind of show y'all what what is going on in my life, a day in my life. I guess I could tell y'all, see y'all could see what's going on today um, on a Saturday and just kind of, um, you know, go around the house and do some few things. I do have lots of laundry. Well, not a lot, but I do have um, laundry to do. So we're going to be doing that as well. I did organize my closet and fold clothes and put some away. Yesterday, y'all, it took me six hours to fold and put away clothes, which usually takes me an hour. I was so tired. I just, I couldn't even move. I was so tired. So anyway, got that done. Um, and what else? What else? What else? I think that's it. I do want to make a wreath for my front door for the Christmas holiday. I want to do something different. It's something big and warm and, you know, in keeping with the style and the color and the tone that I'm going for. Y'all know, y'all know I am going for more of a um, vintage to just traditional, you know, warmth type of style. So we'll see if we can get to that. But just wanted to stop by and say good morning and Hope you guys are having a fantabulous day. Today is supposed to be 65 degrees. So I want to get as much done as I possibly can because it has been so cold, which is seasonally acceptable. I have been loving it. Um, they say we were supposed to get snow, but we didn't. So um, I want to try to get as much done as possible. So I want to go ahead and take you guys around, and I hope that you guys are, will enjoy this video. If this is your first time here, hello and welcome. My name is Shoshana, and on my channel, I do lots of home decor, seasonal decor, uh, motivational cleaning, and sometimes here and there, I do do some vlogs. Um, and so this is one of the vlogs that I do do, day in the life type vlogs. And I hope that you guys will consider subscribing if that is what you are interested in watching. I'm like a lifestyle content creator. So if that's what you're interested in watching, I do upload two to three times a day, two, two to three times a week. Can you imagine if I uploaded two to three times a day? Oh my gosh, totally be burnt out. But um, I do upload two to three times a week and I would love for you to consider being a part of our family here um, on YouTube. So thank you guys so much for stopping by and I hope you guys enjoy this vlog today and let's go ahead and get some work done. <laughs> Y'all, I 
got my Hallmark movies going on. Christmas movies. Y'all know it's countdown to Christmas. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. It's on every channel, by the way. So it's on like Hallmark, Hallmark Movies and Mysteries, um, and it's on Gak Family TV. Y'all, I am in Christmas heaven. <laughs> Sunny day in late July and everything turned upside down I almost lost track of time as weeks went by I couldn't get him off my mind I told him I want that great love Like standing in the middle of a bonfire Don't know how you got there but you hold tight Knowing that you can't get burned Just tell me how we lost track of everything but each other I honestly don't know And tell me how we To the next level Cause I wanted that great love Like standing in the middle of a bonfire You don't know how you got there But you hold tight Knowing that you can't get burned Just tell me how we lost track Of everything but each other I honestly don't know And tell me how we messed up Drifting away from each other Didn't wanna let you go oh, oh, oh. Sunny day in late July and everything turned upside down I almost lost track of time as weeks went by I couldn't get him off my mind
Y'all just saw me build that whole thing. That's supposed to be my DIY plate rack. Epic fail. Um, it just did not look right. It was too heavy. I used two by fours because that's the wood that I had. Um, but I think I need to just go to Home Depot and grab one by twos, one by threes, and one by fours. I think that will work out a whole lot better. It just did not, <laughs> did not look right. So I'm gonna scratch that project. Um, though it took me a bit to figure out, but it's okay. I'm gonna scratch that project for today. I am going to be building one, but I'm gonna go and get the proper wood to do that. In the meantime, what I'm gonna do is just um, paint this wall like a lighter shade of, I don't know, cream, tan, beige, something. Paint that wall and then I'm just gonna make that, or maybe I'll just paint it black because I actually do like the black. Um, but I'm gonna paint the wall and I'm gonna just make that my cutting board wall. So hopefully that, <laughs> hopefully that's not an epic fail. <laughs> But let's go ahead and see what we can do with that. I got the paint. Got my roller. I gotta be honest, I'm so nervous. Though I know what it looks like on the fireplace. <laughs> but I am super nervous. Oh my gosh, it's just paint, right? I can always repaint it if it doesn't come out the way that I think it should. So let's go ahead and get into this painting. Even if you tried, you wouldn't understand it Maybe something's missing inside of you Just a bit of sugar to that heart bitter Maybe you taste different Hold up, hold up, baby I can sit beside you while you're going on about your simple life Nothing left you thinking that maybe you're not different Go on, blow up your ego Your ego Your undenying, undying ego Oh, look, here he goes Stepping on toes With his humble eyes I guess it never hit you Our conversation takes to Paying it some interest from time to time Inside all that greatness and all of your adventures You're all alone So there you have it <laughs> The wall is painted Finally I got I have one more wall to paint isn't that pretty? It's so pretty. I love the way it looks. So I have one more wall to paint and though it makes it look a little darker than normal, um, I'm gonna have some, put, put, not puck lights, what do you call them? The wall, the inlays, the, the lights, the, you know what I'm talking about. I can't think about it right now. But we're gonna have some lights in the ceiling there. And I'm also going to have like picture frame molding lights because I'm putting up some new pictures back here, like a new gallery wall back here. Um, and it's gonna have that vintage feel. So it's gonna have lots of gold and brass and things. So that's what's going back here. Um, just kind of changing it around a little bit. And then I'm also going to do like a little rug, you know? So it's coming along, it looks really good. This wall, y'all, with this wallpaper, oh my gosh, it's just, it's just beautiful so i love the way that it looks i love the way it turned out so once everything dries um i'm actually going to go ahead and film a decorating video um with the cutting board and you guys will get to see that also in the week probably on friday you'll get to see that but i love the way that it turned out i love the way that it looked y'all it's done it's final y'all i've been wanting to do this for I don't even know how long, a year and a half. <laughs> and I'm so glad that it's finally done. Got to paint all over me. But I'm so glad it's finally done. I don't have to think about it. Oh, 
I don't have to think about it no more. No more. It's done. So I'm getting ready to move on to the next task, which is painting the wall upstairs. I'm wondering if I should do that once everybody goes back to school and no one is home to touch the walls, but they did pretty good here. Y'all, we had an ordeal. The kids were locked in the bathroom. Had to get them out, but we got them out. I probably should have filmed it so y'all could see the craziness that was taking place. But um, it's done, y'all. The wall is finally done. And I can finally get to decorate the way that I want to. So let's move on to the next task, y'all. I am tired, okay? Tired. Okay, guys. So, like, real quick, I went on Pinterest because I wanted to make this plate rack and I wanted to make it today. So, I went on Pinterest and I was like, there's got to be another way that I can make this plate rack. Okay. So I found this um, this pin. I'm going to link it down below. I found this pin and it was such an inspiration. And I took the two by twos and the um, one by twos that I had. The two by twos and the one by twos that I had. And I cut them down to size, measured it out. Hey, you guys. My play rack. It's in black. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can see it. I think you guys can see it. But moment of truth. I'm about to put my cutting boards in there and see how they look. Though I'm gonna have a separate wall for cutting boards, but I think that, I don't know. May, I might mix the cutting boards and some plates and stuff like that, but y'all, the moment of truth. The moment of truth. So, there we go. Oh my gosh! <laughs> there we go. You can do that to girl. <laughs> and yo, oh my goodness! Oh <laughs> it's so exciting! It's so exciting! <laughs> yo, oh it worked. Can y'all see that? Can y'all see that? Y'all, I finally got a plate rack. I gotta do some touch-ups with the paint. Y'all, my hair is just crazy. I gotta do some touch-up with the paint. But look how good that looks. It looks so good. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. That's not Hella right now. She's happy too, y'all. But I'm gonna do the decorating and all the things. But y'all, it actually worked. And I'm so excited. I am so excited. It's actually made for my plates. I am gonna put maybe one or two little cutting boards in there. But I'm super excited about it. It looks so good. So I do have this back wall back here that I um I painted as well. I'm thinking I'm going to do like a, like maybe some vintage print um like maybe three pictures going down in a row vintage go ahead baby thank you three pictures going down in a row that's like vintage artwork something um because uh, originally i wanted that to be like my what do you call these things cutting board wall and then <laughs> and then i wanted this wanted this to just be the plate rack but i think that it i think that this can be dual maybe i don't know i'm i'm still thinking but i love the way that this looks y'all it just looks so good so mama is happy i so badly want to throw some dishes wait a second oh yeah can y'all see oh oh can y'all see the vision <laughs> okay let's see here now i'm not decorating it but I just want to see if the plates actually work and they do. Okay, well they don't work together. Ooh, that's not gonna work. Okay, well, let's see. There we go. I mean, I have to play around with it. I definitely have to play around with it and see what fits, what works, you know, what goes. But y'all, I'm so happy. I'm so happy, you guys. I'm so happy. 
All right, well, I gotta do some touch-up work, touch-up paint. I gotta do some touch-up paint right now, so I'm gonna take all this stuff out, put them aside. Y'all gonna see that in the decorating video on Friday, okay? All right, all right. So I'm gonna do some touch-up paint right now, and yeah, I'm so excited.